Hello everybody, it's Aaron. Welcome to another episode of Feed the Beast. Uh, since I'm not really working on a project right now, I decided to have a little fun. And so I went to the nether and I started killing those wither skeleton guys. And I got the first two skulls in like five minutes and I haven't gotten one in like the last hour. However, I did start a, a soul shard. I also got a firebat soul shard because I was trying to kill one of these guys and I couldn't take it off my hot bar before I killed the stupid firebat. So we have a firebat soul shard and this uh, sword, it's pretty awesome. Uh, the knockback is kind of a pain because those guys like to walk on the, uh, the edge of the thing and it's really hard not to knock them off into lava. So I want to do a couple of things today. The first thing I want to do is I want to see if miscraft portals work again. And I know that they work for people, but they had a problem with entities for a while. So I want to go make a new link book in the nether. Set a portal up over here. Actually, you know what? I have a better idea. No, I can't do that. My better idea was going to be... Um, setting up the... Uh, let me take care of this guy. Right in the face. They're so loud. My better idea was going to be setting up the soul cage with the wither skeleton guys in here and having them um, fall through into the real world. But the problem with that is the so the tier one soul cages they don't spawn when you're not there unlike the tier five which just runs all the time i think tier four does as well so um, i already made a receptacle for this thing so let's just um let's just make a portal And let's make it right here. If you remember, these things can be um, any size as long as they as long as they're all connected. But I'm just going to make one that's just. I'm going to say just make one that's just big enough. But I don't have enough crystals. So let's see if this works. You can put your receptacle anywhere on here. Doesn't really matter. Okay, let's um Oh man. I hate it when it auto fills the book. Well let's, let's see what happens. Yeah, looks like they went through with no problem, so that's good. So, I saw a post on Reddit a week or two ago. Somebody wanted to play a prank on their friend, and they wanted to know how to teleport, teleport things into their base. Well, if this is your base, and I run in here and make a link book, you have no way of knowing that. If I put a portal on the other side, guess what? things are just going to start appearing. So, I guess I'm just going to put the spawner over here and just let the guys go. So let's go make a soul cage. And the thing about breaking the soul cage and getting the shard back, what happens is it rounds down to the tier. So since this one is tier one, with 89 kills, it goes back down to 64. So if you're in between tiers, you don't want to break your soul cage. If you're already at tier 5, it doesn't matter because, um, it, you know, it's you, it's not. It, if it rounds down, it's no big deal because uh, it'll just still be tier 5. All right. So since I um, don't need soul stealer for this thing. Uh, because 
it doesn't work on soul cage enemies. Uh, I'll just use the Vorpal and hopefully, hopefully we get something out of it. And you can pick those guys up with the gravity gun. I shot a couple of them across the map. It was pretty fun. While we're here, let's take a look at our at our nether lava. Let's give it a second to load. It is beautiful. Now that we have Tesseracts, there's really no need to hook up a tank, but since it's already there, I'm not going to get rid of it right now. So let's put this thing over here somewhere. I figure we can just put it in here and just let them fall. And then I'll just kill them, you know. Oh, please don't tell me that made a normal skeleton spawner. Why aren't they spawning? Is it too bright? It's the nether. Let's put it right there, see what happens. There we go. I really don't care about fall damage so much. I just, um, I want another head so I could do the wither thing. Come on, spawner. Hopefully they're not spawning on the other side where I can't see. You can gravity gun those guys too. I accidentally gravity gunned a pig man earlier and they were very mad. I should have made a pig man soul shard while I was at it. This thing is very finicky. I don't want it to spawn behind me. Well, maybe I need to make a dark box or something. Hmm. That sucks. But, I can do that. And the good thing about these guys is when they see you, they come for you. Like, much like that. I've gotten a ton of coal from them. Some minium stones, but no damn, no damn heads. I don't know how to make it darker in the nether. It's just, you know, it's the nether. Well, I don't know of a better way to do this since I can't put it in the real world. Unless I put some nether bricks down or something. I don't think that would really do any good. Let's see. I thought it if I put it around it, it might make it darker. But I put cobblestone around things and it... It hasn't made it any darker here because the uh, the nether is just as bright as it is. So I'm going to hang out here for a second see if I can um, get another skull. And if I do, uh, we'll make the damn wither and then we'll kill it with a mining laser. So I'll see you in just a second. Well guys, it's only been 45 minutes and I decided to give up on the spawner. For whatever reason, I didn't feel like sitting there anymore, so I figured I'd come out here one more time and look at this. There they are. It occurred to me that maybe you don't get them from the spawner, but I've gotten skeleton heads from the old um, skeleton spawner, so I don't know why, why I wouldn't get them from this. Anyway, neither here nor there. That's going away.
see it went back down to 64. No big deal. Um, I killed a ton of them. This, these are all the stone swords I got. I don't really want any of them. But um, now we can go make the wither. And I don't really know a lot about this. I know that a mining laser will uh, tear it up. Just like it tears up almost anything. And I also know that I don't want to do it anywhere near our base. I also didn't want to teleport there. So... Oh, come on. You wouldn't think that head would be that hard to knock off the wall. Alright, let me put some stuff away and then, um, then we'll go do this. I think we get, like, uh, some kind of a star from it. We'll find out shortly. Do I have a... Look how many minium shards are in this barrel. Oh, where are you at, Enderman? I got something for you. Not a big fan of Enderman, as you may know. So we'll put away the awesome swords and that. We're not going to need those anymore. Oh, I already had one. Soul Stealer 4 on that one. That would have been better. See, I forgot I had these, so I made a new one and enchanted it and then put it with a book, and I should have just come over here and looked. All right, anyway, no big deal. Let's um, get a little more charge on the gravitation engine. And hopefully this goes better than fighting the Ender Dragon. Um, that was... That was something else, and I, like, you know, I really don't have a plan for this. Oh, I have a nano saber. Why don't I get that? And this, this charges the nano saber too, which is outstanding. Um, I really don't have a plan for the wither guy. I just want to do it, you know, somewhere else. And I would like my world to load. That's that's what another reason I want to move because um, my frame rate over here is terrible. Uh, after I finished that other stuff I was working on on Friday, I played a brand new world all weekend and I was back up in the you know 150 to 200 frames per second range and it was wonderful. Uh oh, is it? Uh, is it raining or something? Alright, so I think I make a T with the soul sand. I don't remember if it's three high or two high. I just saw generic B do this, but I don't remember. Oh, there he is. It was only too high. Whoa. Is he going to do something? Shit. Yeah, he's gonna do something. Where did he go? Wow. He makes awesome noises, I'll give him that. Why does he fly so high? Is that his thing? Is he going to come down? 
That's alright, I'll come to him. He's actually pretty hard to hit with the mining laser. Wow. Boom. Let's go, uh... Is that what I want? Yeah, it is. Nether Star. Sweet. All right, let's see. Um, let's see what happened to the desert here. That was nuts at the beginning. Like he just kind of sat there, and I was like, "All right, what's he gonna do?" And then it's like he charged up. I wonder if I should have just killed him when he was doing that. That was nuts. Wow. All right, so I don't really know what to do with the nether star. I know you can make, like, a pyramid kind of thing with it. But I really don't, you know. As you know, I don't really know that much about... Oh, that looks awesome. Big cube of lava under the base. I really don't know a lot about a lot of the newer vanilla stuff. Let's hit you on this and see what happens. Ooh, that's... Now I can make a portal gun. Oh, a supercharged gravity gun? Oh, shit. Inventory module. Miniature black hole. I don't think I want anything to do with any kind of nuclear anything. The miniature black hole makes a portal gun. The default portal gun. So... I don't really need a portal gun since I can make link books in my own world and make portals with it. So I'm not really going to, I don't really worry about the portal gun. This, I think I could totally get down with that. And then the beacon, and I don't really know a lot about that. So, um, let's make one. You see what I'm what I'm looking at time wise. Uh, I got a couple minutes. Let's make a beacon. What was obsidian and something else? What was it? Glass. I know that you can do something to like um, make effects if you're in a certain radius of the beacon, but that's all I really know. And then, don't you have to put it on glass blocks or something? Yeah, I gotta put it on... Put it on something. I wonder if I... Oh, that's freaking me out. Alright, um, what do we want to do? Diamond block? How about diamond? Somebody said, don't use the diamonds from the, um, from our little expedition to that, uh, Miscraft age. I think I'm going to need three more. But at this point, I mean, I already had so many to begin with. I don't really think it's that big of a deal. I mean, I can run a quarry and come up with that many diamonds. I mean, we have not unlimited power, but I mean, we have a lot of power. Oh, cool. Look at that. Now, speed and haste, to me, are about the same thing. Right. But I have to put a... So it cost me a diamond to use it, and I had to make diamonds to put on the thing? Or emeralds? Yeah, I really didn't think we were going to... Like, get this far with it today, so I didn't actually read up on it. Okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't I don't know what to do. How about one of you one of you guys leave me a comment about what I should do with this thing? <laughs> because I really don't know. I'm gonna go read about it right now, but I I'm pretty sure the size of the pyramid affects the the radius of it. But like I don't know if you have to make it out of diamonds or if you can make it out of gold or silver or what so I'm gonna read about it but why don't you guys give me your suggestions as well because I um like I don't know anything about this so but we have it that's all that matters if nothing else I just want it to shine up into the sky cuz it's a beacon right like Malkuth built a big old pyramid to put one in and I don't want to be a, a copycat but that's like the perfect thing, perfect thing for this because it's a pyramid shape itself. So uh, leave me a comment. Tell me, tell me what you want to do with this thing because eh, really doesn't matter to me. I just wanted to beat the weather because I thought it would be fun, and I can't imagine in doing that with um, vanilla stuff. <laughs> uh, everything's easier when you have all of this awesome awesome stuff so that's two two bosses I never beat the ender dragon in vanilla and I never beat the wither in vanilla because I haven't played vanilla since before the wither was introduced so hooray for modded minecraft that's going to do it for this episode as always leave your questions comments suggestions down below thank you very much for watching we'll see you guys next time